Okay, so there are two types of carbonyl compounds. <coughs> both must contain this group. So both contain this C double bond O group. And the two types are um, ketones and aldehydes, yeah? Yeah, that's right. So we've got ketones, Which is where you have some carbon chain <laughs> with a carbon double bond O and then another carbon chain. And an example of that, well, the simplest one is going to be, what do you reckon? How many carbons, what's the minimum number of carbons I must have? Three. Three. I must have one. Three. Three. Yeah. Three. yeah. So it's going to be carbon, carbon, carbon. Put that on there. What do you reckon he's going to be called? Propanone. Do I need a number to say where my own is? No. It's got to be on that middle one. Wait, so ketones are carbonyl compounds? That's right, carbonyl. Yeah. Carbonyl. <laughs> Aldehydes. They have the R, C, double bond O, but they end with an H. So if I was going to do the same type here, it's got to be on the end. So what's he going to be called? Mm -hmm. Or how many carbons? Propanol. Do I need a number? No. It's got to be on the end. If it had two, what do you reckon it would be called? Two carbonyls, up to two carbons, sorry? Ethanol. Yeah, ethanol, yeah. Or you can call it ethanol. <laughs> and as um, Florence said, if it had just one carbon, it would be methanol. Like so. So that's an aldehyde or a ketone? Yeah, that's an aldehyde. Yeah, so it's another form of aldehyde. Yeah, because it's got that C double bond. Yeah. Now, obviously, if it, if it starts getting more complicated, so if I do another one now, I'm going to draw another ketone. What? Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay. It's all okay. It's all okay. What about this one? CH3, CH2, CH2, C double bond O, CH3. What would he be called? Pentamine. One pentano. Ten, 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 